an ancient Japanese breed. The Shiba Inu is a little but well-muscled dog once employed as a hunter. Today, the spirited good-natured Shiba is the most popular companion dog in Japan. A smaller version of the Akita breed, the Shiba Inu, translates to small dog in Japanese. They are a Spitz-type breed characterized by their thick coat, pointed ears, and curly tail. Famous for their fox-like appearance and cat-like tendencies, Shiba Inus are very loyal and alert with a strong prey instinct and a knack for escaping from gardens. If you've decided that your family needs a new member in the form of a Shiba Inu and you want to learn more about the breed, then you've definitely come to the right place. In this video today, we're going to take a look at the top 10 interesting facts about the Shiba Inu. But before we begin, we'd like to take a moment to express our thanks to all the original Shiba owners in this video. The video would not have been possible without them. So don't forget to check out these adorable dogs from the Instagram profiles that have been linked in the description below. And now, let's begin the list. Number 1. Their History The Shiba Inu is an ancient breed with their origin in Japan. They are one of the oldest known breeds dating back to the 3rd century BC. For centuries, Japanese Shiba Inus were used as hunting dogs and were skilled at hunting birds and game. There are quite a few theories about how the breed got its name. One theory suggests that the word Shiba means brushwood, and the dogs were named for the brushwood bushes in which they hunted. The second theory suggests that the Shiba and the autumn leaves of brushwood leaves share the same fiery red color. And the third one suggests that an archaic meaning of Shiba refers to its small size. Shiba Inus have had a misfortunate past. The breed almost went extinct during the Second World War. And most of the dogs that didn't perish in bombing raids later died due to distemper in the years after the war. Fortunately, some Shibas after the war were brought from the remote countryside and breeding programs were established. And the remaining numbers were interbred to produce the Shibas we know today. An American service family imported the first Shiba Inu into the United States in 1954, but there is little to no documentation about the breed until the 1970s. The first U.S. litter was born in 1979. The breed was recognized in the American Kennel Club miscellaneous class in 1993 and acquired full status with the non-sporting group in 1997. Today, Shibas remain hugely popular in Japan and they've won plenty of farts in America too. The breed ranks 42nd out of 197 dog breeds on the AKC's list. Number 2. Their Appearance The Shiba Inu is a compact but highly athletic dog with a very alert expression, especially when they're excited or playing. And they always seem to have a smile on their face. These pups resemble a fox with their distinctive red coats, bushy tails held over their backs, and their fuzzy, pointy ears. Males stand 14.5 to 16.5 inches tall and weigh about 23 pounds, whereas females stand 13.5 to 15.5 inches tall and weigh about 17 pounds. Their ears are medium-sized, triangular and held erect, and the tail is plumed and tightly curled over their back. These dogs have a thick double coat, the outer coat is stiff and straight, and the undercoat is soft and thick. Their outer coat comes in three standard colors, including black and tan, red and red sesame. Their undercoat is buff, cream or gray. They also have cream to white markings on the cheeks and sides of the nose, cheeks, abdomen and upper throat, legs, inside the ears, under the jaw and tail and around their bum. Number 3. Their Temperament As very confident dogs, Shiba Inus are alert, loyal and lively and they tend to form strong bonds with their owners. However, they can also be quite independent and territorial with a strong hunting instinct. Sometimes aloof, they may come across as indifferent or even cold towards strangers and other dogs, which is why some say their personality resembles that of a cat. Although good-natured, they have an independent streak, so they shouldn't be left off-leash. After all, these dogs are known to chase around anything that piques their interest. However, with proper training, you can have them off-leash in secure areas where there's no danger. You can also unleash them in the woods, where they would absolutely love running around, exercising and playing freely. The breed can also be quite selfish when it comes to their possessions. They sometimes tend to guard their food, toys and their territory aggressively. Shibas can also be very independent at times. When they don't feel like doing what you've asked them to do, they'll surely let you know that they're displeased. But they don't bark or whine. They have a somewhat unique way of focalizing that is affectionately called the Shiba Inu scream. The scream is a high-pitched whining sound that the breed makes when they're excited or agitated. Shibas aren't exactly the best breed when it comes to getting along with other pets unless you give them proper socialization and training from a young age. These dogs will also most definitely chase any small animals they perceive as prey. As for children, the breed can get along well with them as long as the children treat them kindly and respectfully. Number 4. The Iconic Shiba Scream 
Shiba Inus are sometimes nicknamed the drama queens of the dog world because of their unique vocalizations. While they are usually pretty quiet dogs and are mostly suitable for apartment living, when they are upset, they will let out a sharp, quick howl, so you may want to make sure not to upset them. This human-like wail that the breed makes when they're upset or excited has been affectionately termed the Shiba Scream. They're not fans of bats or nail cutting and are absolutely not shy in letting you know about their displeasure. Occasionally, you also hear it when they're super happy, such as when they're playing with other dogs. It is said that Shiba Inus are more closely related to the Grey Wolves, the ancient ancestors of today's domesticated dogs, which is why they still retain some of the wolf-like traits. So the Shiba Scream is sort of a unique take on the primitive wolf howl. Number 5. Their Training Shiba Inus are undeniably intelligent, but they are also quite independent and stubborn at times. The Shiba's temperament is complex and they need a confident pup parent to lead the way, which means they aren't the best choice for a novice dog owner. It's best to start training a Shiba pup from puppyhood. Even at 8 weeks old, these dogs are capable of soaking up anything you teach them. There are quite a few habits you'd want to train your Shiba out of. Make sure your pup understands that they can't snap, growl, or bite to protect their food or their favorite toys and that the other household pets are friends, not foes. The breed can be aggressive toward dogs that they don't know, so early socialization is extremely important. If possible, get your pup into a puppy kindergarten class by the time they're 10 to 12 weeks old and socialize them to many other dogs and situations. One key to training your Shiba Inu puppy is to find something that motivates them, like a favorite treat or toy, and use that as a positive reinforcement training aid. This is important because Shiba Inus, although they're very intelligent dogs, tend to be rather aloof, independent, and strong-willed. Number 6. Their Exercise Requirements the Shiba Inu is an athletic and fairly active dog with average energy levels. But this doesn't necessarily mean they're couch potatoes. They need about an hour or more of exercise a day. Exercising can be a fun game in a fenced-in yard, or it might be a leisurely walk around the park or neighborhood. Some Shibas absolutely love dog sports, and you'll find them performing agility, fly ball, competitive herding, tracking, and even lure coursing. As long as your Shiba feels like it's fun, exercising your dog shouldn't present much of an issue. Just be sure to leash up if you're not in a fenced-in area because they are prone to escape. These dogs will definitely chase anything that catches their interest, so if they are not leashed, they could wander off before you even know. For this reason, a secure fenced-in yard to enjoy off-leash play is a must for the breed. And as long as your pup is off for it, mental stimulation and ball games are also good choices to keep them occupied. Number 7. They are popular dogs Surely everyone has seen or heard of the Doge meme. The meme consists of a picture of a dog accompanied by multicolored text representing an inner monologue in broken English. It in turn led to the Dogecoin and Shiba Inu cryptocurrencies. The Doge meme was everywhere by 2013, and the internet had a new love in the form of a fox-like expressive fluff of a dog, the Shiba Inu. But the Doge meme isn't the only thing that the breed is known for. According to the Guinness World Records, one of the world's oldest living dogs was a Shiba Inu named Pusuki, who died at the age of 26 in 2011, three months shy of his 27th birthday. Described as being very active up to his last day, Pusuki passed away five minutes after his owner returned home from a morning walk. Another famous Shiba Inu is Mari. In 2004, when an earthquake struck the village of Yamakoshi in Japan, Mari sprang into action to save her puppies and her elderly owner. She moved her puppies to a safe place and then found and woke her owner up, who had been trapped underneath a fallen cabinet. Mari's owner was eventually evacuated from the area by a helicopter but had to leave the dogs behind. Two weeks later, the man returned and found Mari and all her pups alive. Mari's unique story was then adapted into a Japanese movie called A Tale of Mari and Her Three Puppies. Number 8. Their Grooming The Shiba Inu is known to shed moderately throughout the year and heavily twice a year when they blow their coat. But despite the extent of shedding, the breed is fairly easy to maintain when it comes to grooming. Considered a very clean breed, Shibas are often known to self-groom in a similar way that a cat does. Brushing their coat once every week to remove dead hair should suffice. During shedding season, however, it's best that you brush their coat more often. As for bathing, it's a good idea to bathe their Shiba once every three to four months. While brushing your dog's coat, make sure to check and clean their ears, eyes, and any other body part to avoid any potential infection. Other than that, make sure you brush your Shiba's teeth at least two to three times a week and trim their nails once or twice a month. Some Shibas can be difficult with groomers or veterinarians, and may even be vocal or aggressive if not used to being handled. Number 9. Their Health 
Generally, Shiba Inus are quite robust and healthy with an average lifespan of 13 to 16 years. But as with any dog breed, they too are prone to a few health conditions. In Shiba Inus, you should expect to see health clearances for hip dysplasia, elbow dysplasia, hypothyroidism, and von Willebrand's disease. Other health conditions that the breed may be prone to include allergies, glaucoma, patellar luxation, and progressive retinal atrophy. Do keep in mind, however, that not all Shiba Inus will get any or all of these diseases, but it's best to be aware of them. As long as you get your pup from a certified breeder with the health clearances of the pup's parents, you could prevent a lot of these diseases, keeping your dog healthy for the most of their life. But no matter how healthy your Shiba may appear, make sure to visit the vet for routine checkups once every while to figure out and possibly prevent any health issues early on. Number 10. Their Diet and Nutrition All dogs love meal time, and Shiba Inus are no exception. Shibas are especially known to be very food motivated. These guys typically do well on a high-quality commercial dog food. Be sure to factor in your dog's age and choose a formula that is best suited for your dog. Generally speaking, one to one and a half cup of high-quality dry food a day divided into two meals is recommended for the breed. Some Shibas are also best known to regulate themselves, so if possible, you can also provide free access to food if you know your Shiba can handle it. Some Shibas are picky and others will eat anything in sight, so you shouldn't worry about a specific diet not working for your Shiba pup. Instead, you could ask your vet or breeder for recommendations on what kind of food would be best suited for your dog. Also, treats can be an important aid in training, but giving too many can cause obesity. We recommend that you follow the 10% rule of dog treats. Treats should make up no more than about 10% of your dog's daily calories intake. Alright folks, with that we've come to the end of our list of top 10 interesting facts about the Shiba Inu. Thank you so much for watching the video. While training the breed can be a difficult task, Shiba Inu still make great and loyal family pets. What are your thoughts on the breed? Do you think a Shiba will be a good fit for you? Let us know in the comments below. And as always, subscribe for more interesting facts in different dog breeds and ring the notification bell to never miss the future uploads. Catch you guys in the next one.